Okay, folks, here we are at Unit 12, the last unit in our study of strategic management of business and technology. And I hope by now you've got a real appreciation for the fact that whether you spend only 5% of your time being a strategic manager or whether you spend 95% of your time being a strategic manager, it's about how well you get a return on that time invested. And that's what the study of strategy really is about. How well do we carry out those strategic management roles in whatever part of our job title says we have to be a strategist. So that's what I'm hoping you've got out of it. And the last peg, the last piece of the puzzle is this notion of understanding that for strategy to work, we really do need to manage our relationship with key strategic stakeholders. You've heard me use the term stakeholders again and again throughout this course. And stakeholders are those people who have not only an interest in the success of our strategy, but some power to influence the outcomes, whether that be positively and help us achieve the outcomes or negatively and hinder the achievement of the outcomes. Either way, anyone who's in a position of both interest and power to affect the outcome of strategy, we need to manage that relationship. And it's a really simple process of identifying who the stakeholders are, identifying their interest in the strategy, identifying their current attitude or uh, perspective or level of commitment and positivity or negativity about the strategy and then seeking to either support those people who are helping us or change the behaviour of those people who aren't. So first we need to recognise who they are, then we need to assess their current state and then we need to come up with a way of changing the behaviour or supporting the behaviour so that the stakeholders become part of the sound of marching feet. They become part of the drive to help us make the strategy succeed. They become engaged in our success. So Unit 12 is all about strategic stakeholders. Having said that, I do want to close out by thanking you for your commitment to the subject, by thanking you for your participation in the subject. Uh, I hope you've got a lot out of the subject and I hope you've enjoyed it and I hope you've really also been able to contribute to the enjoyment and the learning of others because that really is one of the keys to success as adult learners but also a key part of the MBT program. I wish you all the very best in your careers coming up after you finish this and in the exam that's to follow.